Hello, Roger Foxwell here, and thanks for joining me. Today I want to talk about emotional freedom technique and give you a rough guide of the issues that connect each tapping point to the meridian lines in the body. I'm often asked what issue each tapping point relates to, and although it is not necessary to know, it is interesting to have an idea of some of the emotional connections represented by each meridian point. An acupuncturist would put needles on these points. In EFT we can tap on them to help get stuck energy moving around the body and mind. I originally trained in TFT, Thought Field Therapy, devised by Dr. Roger Callahan, which is a technique that EFT grew from, developed by Gary Craig. In TFT, there are certain combinations of points one would tap on for each particular issue, whereas in EFT, we generally tap around all the points in a certain order, whilst verbalising out loud or to ourselves how we are feeling about the issues we are working on. This makes it easy to use at home. It is very simple to remember the sequence. So whether I'm helping clients tap to release past issues, to feel confident at work or take a driving test, the basic sequence is always the same. So we start tapping on the side of the hand like this and we acknowledge how we feel and the issue we are working on. We might say, even though I have this issue, I completely value and accept myself. And then continuing with our own thoughts, we'll tap on the inside of the eyebrow, which represents trauma, hurt, sadness. The outside of the eyebrow, rage, anger, frustration. Under the eye, fear, anxiety, worry, could be some of the issues that come up. Under the nose, shame, guilt, grief. Under the lip, confusion, embarrassment, uncertainty. The collarbone, just sort of slap that with your fingers. Worry, stuck, indecision. Under the arm, insecurity, obsession, self-esteem. The top of the head, just there. Lack of focus, ruminating, stuck in mental loops. So you won't need to remember what each point is about, since these issues are all interconnected anyway. I hope that answers a few questions about emotional freedom technique. It certainly is a very powerful and very valuable technique. Thanks for watching. If you found the video helpful, please hit the like button and feel free to leave any comments below. See you on the next video.